What's up, guys? Welcome back to、um, JWL. It's been a while since we posted a podcast.、Um, so, we have a good video planned. So, our first topic is、uh, Isaiah. He is our、uh, fifth round pick、uh, to the platypuses from Caleb drafted him. And he got. Uh, injured in a four wheeler、uh, over the weekend of the、uh, break that we had.、Um, so, he has, so he can't be like exposed to the sun for a little while, and he,、um, he has a little bit of road rash. So he won't be on JWL for like a couple weeks. So we're gonna have Yaya attack our、um, statistician. But I just want to do much,、uh, don't really need much stats because we have it figured out. So he's going to be our、um, substitute for Isaiah because we did say that if we ever need a backup, then Yaya or Alex would be that guy. So Yaya's going to fill in for the platypuses for a little bit. Alright. So. Yeah, that's like. So, that's our first、uh, segment. Segment two,、uh, our new team. So,、uh, we, this is our first expansion team of JWL. They will be joining JWL starting、uh, in the next couple games. They're called the San Diego Sluggers. They have a really nice logo. And, uh,. Yeah, so this team is Yaya, and someone's、uh, on our NGWL Caleb, the、uh, Platypus' captain, his little brother, Micah Root. He hits tanks, a great pitcher, a great fielder, plays baseball, and he's like, he's really good. So look out for the sluggers. They're going to be probably a bit good. So you might be asking, like, how are we going to fit them in? We're going to have. Um, so, we're gonna have them play the ballers, which is Charlie and Lucas. And then the sluggers are then gonna play the orangutans. And then the orangutans will play the nighthawks. And then we're gonna have the all star break. So, the all star break consists of the best player of each team in each division. So, there's the west division and the east division. The west division. Is the Nighthawks, which is Colton and Finn, the Screwballs, which is Carter, me, and Leo, and then the news team, the San Diego Sluggers, will be in our division. So the four, three, the three best players in that division go to the All Star team, and then three best players from the East division, which is The ballers, platypuses, and orangutans are going to be in the All Star game. But on that All Star game、uh, day, we're going to have the home run derby, which is one person from each team chooses a player and they will be in the home run derby. So the home run derby is going to be really fun. We're going to have so, like, some side action for you guys. And yeah, look out for the home run derby. That's going to be fun. Um, segment three. So, we're coming out with the video from the、uh, JWL draft. See,、so、we didn't post it when, back when like, the draft happened. So, we're going to post it sometime soon about like,、uh, like what happened in the draft. So, that's going to be fun to watch. You guys get to see that. Also, segment four predictions. So, predictions. Many people have some hot takes. The、uh, captain of the Nighthawks, Colton Carazon. I think he's gonna go 6 1. So he's currently 3 1 right now. So I think they're only gonna lose against the Rangtangs maybe once or not even. Even once they have been confident. The Nighthawks are a very confident team.、Um, most of the、uh, GWO, except for a couple of players, I think that the Screwballs, which is my team with Leo, are going to be 1 7 or 2 6. I don't believe that. We're gonna beat the, some of the teams like five, 
one. We're gonna beat the Platypuses once, and we're gonna beat the uh, Ballers once. So, uh, we we're doing um, the hitting title, Silver Slugger, which is most home runs, and the hitting title is uh, best average. Um, Gold Glove and Cy Young. So, Cy Young is the most strikeouts, and Gold Glove is. I'm gonna watch all the games and see who's have the uh, best fielding abilities. So my predictions for the uh, awards. So the first one, the hitting title, I think it's gonna go to either Colton Carazon or Axel Backlund. So they, Axel has like a really good batting average, it's like 700, 800, I don't know. So he doesn't have many at bats, but he's gonna, probably do good. You probably won't strike out like probably strike out like twice, maybe three times. And if not, he'll ground out or feel the choice or pop out. He doesn't get out that much. He usually gets on base with a nice hard hit. And same thing with Colton. Colton knows uh, where to hit the ball, how to hit the ball. And he doesn't strike out too often. He's a very talented hitter and he's a good contact hitter. So I think either Colton or Axel will win that title. Um, the reason why not some other people, like um, me for example, I, I'd probably get out a little more often, or like Caleb might struck out like one or two more times than Axel would. So that's why I think uh, Axel or Colton would definitely get the pink title. So number two is um, Silver Slugger. Silver Slugger will probably go to Caleb. Caleb, uh, he's a very dominant hitter. He hits the ball for power and hits the ball. Uh, another contender for that would be Axel. Axel hits a lot of uh, moon shots. So Caleb and Axel would get that definitely. Probably Caleb, because he's confident in the box and so is Axel. But I think Caleb's gonna be my silver stellar creation. Oh, and we're doing MVP too. We'll do that too. Uh, gold Glove, Gold Glove is going to, I actually don't know Gold Glove. Um, I have to think about that. Let's see, so Micah, probably not, because he hasn't started yet. Zaya, probably not. Leo, and Colton, maybe. Colton's had some good plays. Um, Colton's had a good player, too. I think Axel actually has had, probably, Axel's had like two or three good plays in the uh, two games that he's played. So probably another one, Axel. Um, Cy Young. So, so the most like, strikeouts and the most dominant pitcher. It'd probably be one of the captains on the team. So. Hmm. I'd say Either like Colton or me, because we've thrown the most strikeouts, but we've also played the most games. And Colton have played the most games. So, probably, as of now, Colton or me. But, uh, yeah, that's for that. Um, MVP, I'm going to say Caleb Root. Caleb has been very good in the box. Um, he's contributed a lot for his team. Right now he's one and two, and he's carried along the way. Like he's actually like a great hitter and a great pitcher, a great fielder. Not saying the other guys are, but he's just going around the way. Like he's like very good at all of them. So I would say Caleb Root for MVP as of now. MVP contenders would be Axel, Micah, Colton. Why am I doing that? Oh uh, yeah, there's a light here. Yeah. Anyway, about the sluggers again. So the captain of the sluggers is Yaya. We emailed Micah today that he's been drafted. The JWL. So that's yeah. So yeah, as a captain, 
Um, they have a pretty good logo too, so uh, I'm gonna, I'll release that after this. And I'll post the logo on the community page. So look out for that. Oh uh, yeah, so mm -hmm. Slugger's probably gonna be. So hi, right, I'll I'll rank I'll rank the teams. I'll rank the teams. So number one is gonna be the orangutans. They're gonna go seven one. The orangutans have they lost yet? They haven't. The orangutans haven't lost yet. So the orangutans haven't lost yet. So. Not because of that, I just think that they can, they have no real hard competition. Um, we'll see how the Sluggers play. If they do good, then that might be competition, but also the Nighthawks are like the best competition. I think they could potentially sweep the Nighthawks or at least go one-on-one. -on -one. So I'm gonna say seven and one against the Nighthawks, the Northern Nighthawks. So that's why the Orient Tanks were seven and one. So they're gonna go in the first seed. The two seed is going to be the Nighthawks. The Nighthawks, um, they're gonna go a solid six and two. So they're right now at three and one. They have two, wait, they're three and one. They're two and one. Yeah, they're two and one, my bad. Nighthawks right now are two and one. Uh, so they have one loss, which is against us we beat them once and lost to them once so they're probably gonna go six and two maybe five and three if they lose to like the platypus is to take them or sluggers so probably six and two i'm assuming if things go right for the nighthawks so they'd be in second seed the next the third seed would probably be the baller uh not the ball Platypuses. The platypuses are great because Caleb, MVP contestant, as I said, great hitter. Um, so as of now, Yaya or Isaiah is gonna come back soon. So they'd be third seed definitely because they're they're a strong team. They don't have the best chemistry, but it's okay because the chemistry are good. Uh, so the four seed would be the San Diego Sluggers, 100%. Um, San Diego Sluggers, third seed, because Micah hits tanks. Micah's a confident fielder, except he's younger, so I don't know how he would be. Um, how would he, his confidence or performance, his talent won't change, but he'll probably do pretty good. And the season was solid, like five to eight home runs. And the fifth seed would be the St. Louis Screwballs. Or we might tie for four seed, I don't know. Some people say we're gonna go one and seven or two and six, but we're gonna probably beat the Papuses once, beat the ballers at least once, probably sweep the ballers. So I'm gonna say we're gonna go four and four. I'm gonna say we're gonna go four and four, yeah. In the fifth seed, and then the sixth seed is definitely gonna be the ballers. They just don't have like one person to carry them. Both of them are like above me, like half decent. So there's no seat. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe to see all the new JWL. We're gonna play soon. So bye.